Hello everybody, welcome back. We are at the house that's hiding something. So we're going to do a little bit of clean up here, do some decorating and see what we can get from the sale of this house. We've got $181,000 right now. That's after the sale of the Huxter's house. And hopefully we can make some more. So let's start cleaning. Bathroom. Nice size bedroom. And a big hole in the wall. Okay, so let's sell. rid of some stuff and then we can clean up. Oh, another hole in the wall. Okay. Get rid of some of the lights. Start scrubbing. We can repurpose that. I'll leave it there for now. Not much dirt left. No, it isn't. Well, not here anyhow. Outside is another matter. Hmm. Clean windows. some stuff here too in the fittings because we can always reimagine it right windows let's finish the windows upstairs and then we can go downstairs into the basement The garden is a mess. Okay, let's go downstairs. 
Let's see what we can find down here. Ooh, boxes and boxes and boxes. Wheelie bunny. Okay, not much rubbish. Get rid of the shelves and the light. Fix the fuse. And we're done. Power has been restored. So, why it says the house that is hiding something? There is a room next to us over here. It has no door. Can you see that? No door. So, let's make one. Look at that starry, starry night. Isn't that beautiful? So, let's see. The chair costs $981. Yay! The cupboard costs $123. And the picture costs... $56,099.41 We sell it? Do we keep it? I say sell it. And we've got lots of money now. How cool is that? We've got a nice basement down here that we can turn into a, I don't know, bathroom, sauna, games room. Let's see what we can come up with. Let's go start upstairs. So we've got it's quite a small area. Kitchen, dining room, living room, bedroom, bathroom. We can always extend the wall out here and make the bedroom smaller to give us more space here if we wanted to. But the, these, this L-shaped, you can see the exterior wall actually isn't an L-shape. So you can't really get much space because then you've got a funny little L. But we can extend it out by one brick if we wanted to because then we could get a um, a sofa in here if we wanted or we could put a TV unit here hmm let's think about that while we go outside and clean the exterior what do you say Get all this rubbish off it. Very little blue house. No more graffiti. Yeah. 
thinking we'd sell this and then we've got a bit more space out here we could even put a, a window in here because that's the staircase to go down to the basement that's the, the window can go right there and give us some light into the basement okay before we do anything else i guess we're going to have to plaster some walls let's do that Bring the plaster in here. Yeah. And there's still one hole left. Yes. And it's right. Yeah. And I would say everybody's happy now. Let's put the plaster over here for now. I actually like these floors. I like this colour wood. Works nicely with the doors. The bathroom's terrible. But that can be sorted out. I'm thinking maybe we can let's see. This is the bathroom here. You can either put a shower and a bath in there. Or we can knock a door through so it's an ensuite. Decisions, decisions. And today, I'm in the mood for decisions. So let's take this and place it where I was thinking of putting it. Let's put it there because it's a nice little cupboard. I think the plaster we're done with so we can sell that and then we can decide on what we're going to do with the main area we can either go simple and 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 neutral but we've been there we can go a little bit over the top been there so maybe find a middle road this time Let's have a look at what we can do to the walls. I'm thinking of panels, maybe. Something. A brown panel. Uh, are these panels? Are these floors light brown or are they dark brown? I would say light brown, maybe. Let's have a look. Maybe not. The wood is off and it's just going to irritate me. So those are the light ones and they're still not quite the right colour. I don't want to go for a white panel. Perhaps wallpaper? Some nice wallpapers, but a lot of them are bedroom-ish or sunroom-ish rather than main areas. Look at the paints. I'm thinking blues. Some nice blues here. Got some light blues like that 
if we go gradient set let's see what we've got in the way of blues not looking at the turquoise blue so much this time I'm looking at these blues an interesting color maybe we should try that oh looking at it in the pot that's a very bright blue maybe not how blue is this blue not too bad that's almost a gray blue think about that how dark is this let's start with this and see what it looks like. Not a bad colour. I'm thinking blue, white, grey. You think of Delft, China, with a hint of a hint of grey. That could be something interesting. Been slightly inspired by Starry Night. Not completely, but a little bit. just to here for the kitchen do we put a little kitchenette in here but let's figure it out white kitchen cupboards let's do all the walls while we're here we can always come back and move and tile Got a, a base to work from. We have paint. Let's move that out of the way. 
and then come and stand here and have a look. So, if we have someone staying here on their own single bed, we put a little kitchenette in here, or even close that door off and make it an ensuite. That might work because then we can use this whole area as a little kitchenette and that is the lounge dining room. I think that's an idea. I painted you and now I'm demolishing you. since we've had a new skill point. Mm, faster painting, paint three walls at the same time. I'm gonna go, ooh, another new negotiation skill. Okay, well we usually do all the requirements of the job, but it's always nice to have. We'll come back and think about if we want to tile there. But in the meantime, I suppose we better go bash a hole in the wall for the bathroom. Let's see. Let's start here. going to pull it in for now so maybe we can bash some more walls out but at least we can get into the bathroom from the bedroom so if we make the bathroom slightly smaller it will still work because we've got a full bathroom downstairs as well oopsie <laughs> walking into the windows and the walls and the doors Okay, kitchenette, lounge, dining room. Now we were talking about Delft, so let's go for white curtains. Just a simple plane that I go for. A simple plane, very floofy. These ones are full length either. Light colored, narrow, white, silver. can introduce another colour in. I wish these curtains were full length. Right. Nice and, and bright. Let's take the vent off the wall because it's not exactly a kitchen anymore and have a look here we've got enough for a little fridge stove sink kitchen 
thinking of something fairly simple. Maybe something like this. We can get it in white wood. Be simple. And we can, let's see. It's actually the colourful top appeals to me. Go for black handles. Wow. That's got a little bit of interest to it. What do you say? And we will need sixty centimeter white colorful. have much space because we'll have a fridge there and a stove but maybe a drawer unit we will be able to get through there let's find a slightly narrower unit We can find a skinny fridge. Ah, sink. Forgot the sink. Do we have a sink? Sure, we have a sink. Oh, it's a double sink. Let's leave it there for now and figure out a fridge. Thinking of something simple, narrow, probably something like this. That will work well. But we are going to probably have to move that. We can still get down the stairs. We have place for a little bin. We have everything we need. Very good. Let's go back here and find some hanging cupboards.
Ramesh. Let's just add another one or two on this wall. We can always jiggle them around and see if there's a narrow one. A very narrow one. Will that work? Is a let's see. It's thirty five. So let's see if this will fit. of these the kitchen it you can do stove top prefer the stove tops pretty stuff eventually it doesn't line up now the question is do I put another cupboard here lines up perfectly with the door frame. Awesome. Okay. We need a bin. If I don't do it now, I'm going to probably forget to do it. Let's find a bin for the kitchen. About something like that. There we go. Almost like it was meant to be there. And this one. Go. All right, kitchen. A little table here. To make the living room and put a little table here. I think this table, this table, this wall is perfect for a a TV. Let's put the TV up now. And you know, 
You know those crates that I was I was I've been drooling over. I'm going to use them here. I really like them. These crates, there. And they come in white. And yes, I'm going to have to move the TV up and mention. a smidgen more. I think that will work well. You can put in a, a nice comfy sofa, perhaps an L shape. I've got a couple of L shapes. How about something like this? That way. Go light blue on the pillows. We can do any colour we like. Actually, I like it with the canary. And do darker. very well. The thought process is, let's go back to and look at dining room, maybe something like this. black we've got the black handles in the kitchen we can put a couple of chairs nice cafe style so there's the chair black and white because it's got the basket weave on it which is quite nice let's see there we go that fits just perfectly there and we can maybe put a nice cozy chair in the corner there They're leaning towards us but I think it's going to be too big so let's try it never quite work together but I will will accept and not fight with the system and here I'm thinking I can make a little book shelf Is that one? We can 
add it. There's a place for your documents indeed. We can just get a nice coffee table. It's amazing how indecision in the last bowl just like threw me off. Coffee table. What a lovely living room. I agree. Get blank there, briefly. And this will work with all the blues and the whites. Thinking of law. Here's a floral carpet. Just not sure how big it is. Yeah, it's teeny tiny. Maybe not. This one, blue. Where was that other carpet that I saw? This one, I'm sure it has stripes. There we go. If not, why not? Got a whole bunch of different blues in here, but we'll just pretend it's all the same blue. And perhaps something on the wall here by the dining room table. How are you doing? Should we buy the Van Gogh back? I think that's a <laughs> I think that would be fairly appropriate, don't you? There we go. It just costs way less than the original. Okay, and then we can put some Interesting little bits and bobs. We put a Wicker, no, it's not long enough. Let's find another one. Something like that. Let's go white. Over the dining room table. Let's try and. Oh, I did almost center it this time. That's almost impressive. There we go. be looking for his accessories because I think some books would be a good idea. Bookshelf.
some other stuff. It fits perfectly. Ah. Very cool. that it's like a head on to the box the dark blue something different we need a little plant and ends around. We've got some little plants. Maybe a pop purple, pop pink. You fit in there? Yes, you will. Yes, it's in front of the TV, but nobody will actually notice. standing pictures there's one of a very pretty yellow plant that's in a black frame there's a plant isn't it Interesting. Sure, let's go for the set. Great. Let's put some stuff in the kitchen.
glitter table mitt. How cool is that? Right, I'm thinking some. We do have a wall. Chopping board. How about a navy blue one? stir the food with <laughs> some jars car have jars how do these come in? kitchen would be complete without an eye. My question I have is do I tile this or do I leave it painted? I like it with the paint. I think I'm going to leave it with the paint. But we will need a light or two in here so we can see what we're doing. Lights. Okay, so we've done the lounge, we've done the kitchen, and we've done a little dinette area, eating area. So I think I'm going to call it for today, and then have a look, see what we can do for the next one, for the bedroom and the bathroom. So thank you so much for watching. Let's have a lovely day and I'll see you all soon. Bye.